Hi, I'm Rob from SkidSteerSolutions.com. I'm here with the Terra Mix & Go BMX 250 Compact Cement Mixer. The Terra manufactures two models in the Mix & Go series of compact cement mixers. The BMX 250 is for smaller machines, up to about a weight class of 2,700 pounds, and the BMX 450 is for machines with a lifting capacity of 2,700 plus. The Mix & Go cement mixers are a scooping style mixer, meaning there's a full cutting edge here, just like you would see on a bucket. This enables you to take your skid steer loader or excavator, go up to the pile and actually scoop the material into here. You can also load bags on here. If you look at the top here, it's actually got a bag cutter on here. And so you can take a bag of uh, Saycrete or Ready Mix, throw it on here, it cuts the bag, the material falls down inside the chute. All of the Aterra mixers feature a, an enclosed chain drive gear reduction system with an integrated motor. What we're going to do is we're going to do some bag mix today using some Saycrete. This is Ready Mix concrete. So it's already got the sand, the gravel, and the Portland cement already mixed into the bags. So this gives you a good representation of just how full it is with uh, being two-thirds full. What I'm going to do now is I'm just going to turn it on and let it run so that you can see what it looks like when it's running dry. A lot of people don't believe that it has enough horsepower to actually turn dry material, but actually it does. It has no problem at all. So now that I've got the concrete mixer loaded, what I'm going to do is I'm going to add my water in predetermined amounts. So what I've done is I've pre-filled five gallon buckets of water and I'm just going to slowly load them so that I can pick up the consistency that I want. From there I'll be able to record how much water I used and so for future batches they will always be consistent. What we're going to do is use the side chute here and we're going to fill up these forms. Uh, these forms are set up as with two by four sides and they're two foot by two foot uh, in diameter and this will give you a representation of how much material you're going to get out of this machine at two thirds full. So we managed to cover just about 16 square feet using two thirds of the hopper full which was eight bags of uh, ready mix. If you look, the, uh, the auger system completely cleaned this out. So now we have, uh, we have to do a little bit of cleanup on here, but it's too minimal. And all we're gonna do is just use fresh water and I'm gonna show you how to do that next. What I'm gonna demonstrate now is the scooping and mixing feature of the BMX 250. We've had a load of sand gravel mix already delivered. I've got a 100 pound sack of uh, Portland cement ready to go. So what we're going to do now is we're just going to scoop it in to the uh, mixer, mix up the cement, and then we'll uh, add our water. As you can see, all of the BMX models handle dry mix no problem. We've had people buy this, not just for mixing concrete, but for mixing other types of material and dry mixing it and then using the center chute just to dump it out. So anything you want to throw at this, with this auger paddle combination works like a charm. So we've just completed our pour using the BMX 250. We poured approximately 31 square feet uh, in two by four forms. Uh, we do have a bigger unit, it's the BMX 450 if you've got a larger machine and you wanna do larger pours. If you enjoyed this video, 
Subscribe to our channel, click the like button, and visit us at skidsteersolutions.com.